Let's see how many miles this thing has. The moment. What the what? What's up guys welcome to car fix this is your buddy tiago here and uh we have a little treat over here for you guys i picked up this ridge line i have no idea how many miles it has i have no idea what's the condition of it but we're gonna check it out okay it doesn't look too bad under here Some kind of dust over here. Looks like maybe this car's been sitting for a while, or is it? I don't know. We'll find out. Let's put the jumper box on. So, all right. So we put the red on the red, and we put the black, black down here. Let's see how many miles this thing has. All right. Let's check it out. Let's see how many miles this thing has. The moment. What the what? No, that can't be true. Three hold on a second. Is that what I see right there? Is that what I see? Three hundred and sixty thousand six hundred and twenty-five miles on this thing. What? This is so crazy, man. What? <laughs> I mean, it, it is a Honda. That's crazy. Let's see if this thing starts. Ready? Man, this is a surprise here. All right, I got the key in. All right, let's watch that RPM right there. Uh oh, oh, it starts. <laughs> no way, dude. 360,000 miles this thing still starts and I winched it on top of the the trailer I didn't even know this thing starts let's see how this thing sounds dude it doesn't sound bad at all that's crazy look at that smells kind of funky Dude, it's running. That is insane, bro. That is crazy. A little smoke is coming from there. What? That's insane. That is nuts. That's crazy. What is going on here? 360,000 miles. And it still runs. What? Dude, this is crazy. Oh, gotta enter the cold. This is nuts. All right, let's shut it off. I don't know. I don't know if that, that excites you, but it excites me. I don't know if that gets you excited, but every time I see a car with a high mileage and it starts and it still runs, that excites me. I don't know about you guys. All right. Let me uh, take these things out. Let me take the, the clips out. Man, look, there's a little smoke coming through there. There's some, maybe some type of vacuum line or something like that goes there. But wow, that's crazy. It still freaking runs, guy. Let's see what's under here. That's where the oil is. Wow. Whew. 
Oh man, all right. So, since I can't find the dipstick in this car, since I can't find to check the oil or anything like that, I mean, I don't see it. Do you guys see it? Oh, there's one right there. I think that's the transmission. Dude, it's stuck. It's not coming out. That's the transmission oil. The level on it was pretty low. Let's check it again. Man, that that dipstick was there, like tight. That's insane. All right. So after 360,000 miles, it has some uh, some body peeling right here in front of the nose. Over here, there's some here too. Um, we have damage there. Um, we'll go around the body first and then we go check under the deck. There's something there. Mm -mm. Thing there, the light has been broken. Um, this side, the bumper's been off, it's not aligned. You know, it has 360,000. I mean, some, some ding right there, some scratches. Normal wear of a car that's been around, you know, a lot of places with that many mileage. All right, let's see if there's anything on top of the, the roof there. Let's see how on top looks like. Here's the bed. Bed looks pretty good. There's some sun damage maybe. Over here in the back. And then the top looks pretty good. Some scratches here. Some scratches there, some some discoloration here. That's not bad. The windows still in good condition. There's some boots here. If you like, there's a plane. Ooh. Tailgate still looks good. All right. Let's see how the frame is after 360,000. Man, for a New England truck, this is not bad at all. A few rusts there. That's the back. Right there. There's a differential transfer case, whatever you guys call that. Let's go check the sides. Look at that, man. That's not bad at all. There's the front right there. No rust, man. Like, very minor. Very minor. If any. Here's under the wheel well. There's under the motor. There's the catalytic converter there. There's some, maybe I don't know what happened here, but there's just some, uh, maybe some gasket issues right there where the oil pan is. A little transmission leakage there. A little transmission leak. Leakage. But man, wow. This was an exciting day. 
to see a truck that I picked up and I didn't even know how many miles it had and it had 360,000 miles I thought that was exciting for me to find out how many miles this thing has and and how it still looks good overall um, if you guys are looking for a, a good jump box a GNC uh, it's called a jump and carry it's uh, pretty good I had good luck with that if you guys want that I'll put that uh, in the description below so you guys can where you guys can find it and if you guys do end up buying it it will help my channel so uh thank you very much guys yeah subscribe help me uh get to uh a thousand subscribers and i'll be uh giving away uh, a few things i'm not gonna tell you what it is yet but thank you guys have a good one see you later see you on the next one bye for now